Top 10. Best Home Projector Screen. Number 10. Elite Screens Yard Master 2. If you're looking for a screen that can pull double duty as both an indoor and outdoor system, then it's worth checking out the Elite Screens Yard Master 2. We think it's the best double duty screen on this list, with a better picture than the cheaper Gile PLM 100 inch 2 in 1. The robust construction and high quality materials make the Yard Master 2 a good pick, and, as a bonus, it's exceptionally easy to set up. It comes in a variety of sizes, all the way up to 180. We flagged the 120 version here, which should be more than enough for most people, the availability of larger versions varies depending on the store. One thing to note with this model is that it may take a little time and experimentation to get the best picture quality from it. The Elite Screens Yard Master 2 is an excellent screen, but it felt a bit unforgiving. As such, it may be worth sacrificing picture quality for ease of use if you are new to home projection. Number 9. Elite Screens ENCLRUST 100. The Elite Screens ENCLRUST 100 is a screen designed for ultra short throw projectors as in, ones that are directly beneath the screen. This model is one of the better ultra short throw screens available, despite not being quite as assured as the Screen Innovation Solo Pro 2, and costs just over a quarter of the price. It offers outstanding picture, especially in rooms which are not perfectly dark. Although the grey shade might not look great when it isn't being used, it's able to push back up to 65% off angle ambient light. That means that you can get away with just closing the curtains without having to worry about stray ambient lighting sneaking in. However, to get this effect, you will require a really good projector, which can easily double the total setup cost. Other similarly priced screens, such as the Stewart Film Screen SEMA 135, are a little more forgiving with low quality projectors. Number 8. Sunco 15 Feet Inflatable. Inflatable outdoor projector screens tend to be massive, it's sort of the point, and the Sunco Inflatable Movie Screen is no exception. It's a gigantic 120 inches wide, with 12.5 square feet of viewing area. Inflating it is relatively simple and although it doesn't match the clarity and sharpness of indoor screens, it's a perfectly acceptable option for hosting an impromptu outdoor movie night. The problem is that there are better options available. The giant Jemmy Airblown is still the leader in this particular category. Although it's more expensive, by about $30, it's also larger and even easier to set up than the Sunku. The world of inflatable projector screens is a crowded one, and although the Sunku is a viable alternative to the Jemmy, it lacks any killer features to elevate it to a true essential. Number 7. Stewart Film Screen SEMA 135. Stewart makes some of the most expensive screens available, so it's a good thing the image quality matches the price. The SEMA 135 isn't quite as mind-blowing as the Phantom HALR, but it's very good, with a big viewing area matched by some excellent picture quality. It's relatively easy to set up and use, and we think that were it not for the eye-melting price tag, it would probably snag a spot on the regular list. They use their own material, Tiburon G2, which has been tuned and calibrated to provide optimal viewing conditions at almost all angles. It rejects 40% of ambient light, and although it doesn't really handle 3D, the smooth, durable, grey surface provides stunning quality, provided you've got a decent projector to match it. 
This screen and its variants are definitely not for everyone, but you do get what you pay for, and this is an absolute monster of a product. Number 6. Amazon Basics 16 colon 9 pull. Amazon's business model is simple. See what's selling, then make their own. And while the Amazon Basics 16 colon 9 pull down projector screen isn't going to compete with dedicated projector screen companies it's a surprisingly effective option for small rooms. The 80 inch size does a good job of being compact while still giving a usable viewing area, and the smooth roll down mechanism means you can store the screen when not in use. As with many screens in this price range, the Amazon Basics 16 colon 9 pull down projector screen suffers from a few quality issues. The non-tensioned surface can display wrinkles, and you shouldn't expect high-end viewing quality. Our top overall budget option, the Vambo Indoor-Outdoor, may be more expensive but it smokes the Amazon screen in terms of quality. Number 5. Pile PRJTP46 Portable projector screens can be hit or miss, but the Pile PRJTP46 is definitely a hit. Its small size and lightweight make it easy to take with you, and it sets up in moments. It's the ideal screen for impromptu movie nights at a friend's house, or quick presentations while at work. The image is bright and clean and although pricier screens like the Vambo Indoor Outdoor have the pile beaten on clarity, the quality is still good for the price. One thing to be aware of with the Pile PRJTP46 is that the design isn't as robust as we'd like. The portable nature means that it's somewhat flimsy, and can be knocked over or out of true if you brush against it. The viewing surface also has a tendency to not be completely flat, with more than one wrinkle popping up when we tried it. Number 4 Elite Screen Spectrum 2 Any manufacturer can attach a motor to a screen, but only a few can do it really well. Elite screens make the best on the market, in our opinion, and their Spectrum 2 proves it. The screen uses a tubular motor, which is much quieter, faster, and smoother than the synchronous motors found in screens like Elite's VMAX2. The inclusion of the new Max White FG material not only stiffens this non-tensioned screen, but also enhances the picture. We don't think it beats the VMAX2 or other motorized screens like the Screen Innovation Solo Pro 2 for quality, but it more than holds its own. The biggest downside is the price. The Elite Screen Spectrum 2 is almost $100 more expensive than the original, and that may raise a few eyebrows. However, if you're prepared to spend the money, you'll get what is commonly considered to be one of the best motorized screens around. Number 3. Jemmy 44743 Now here's something a bit different in an outdoor screen. This giant Jemmy model inflates like a bouncy castle, so you won't need to mess around with pegs and guy ropes. It's 151 inches wide and 85 inches tall, and even though the picture isn't the sharpest on this list, you're still guaranteed lots of fun at the next barbecue. There's nothing to stop you using it indoors, too although it won't beat out similarly priced models from Epson and Elite screens on this count. This screen includes a power adapter and self-inflates no need to put your lungs to the test and comes with a large carrying case to help cart it around. The giant Jemmy is perfect for an outdoor movie night or sporting event with a crowd of people, but keep in mind that picture quality can't be expected to match an indoor screen. We should say from the get-go that tracking down stats, like again and aspect ratio, is surprisingly difficult for the screen. 
As we mentioned, go in prepared to deal with a surface that might not be ideal for your projector. Number 2. Bamboo Outdoor Indoor Up until recently, we've recommended Silver Ticket as the go-to brand for affordable projector screens. They recently discontinued many of their products, and are no longer widely available. Fortunately, there are several other excellent options, and one of them is the Bamboo Outdoor Indoor Screen. It's basic and functional, but it has several key advantages to other screens from the likes of Ndevedron. For starters, it's exceptionally easy to put together, and we think the picture is comparable to some of the more expensive screens mentioned here, like the Elite Screens Spectrum 2. However, despite the Bamboo Outdoor Indoor claiming that it can be used, well, both indoors and outdoors, the reality is a little more complex. Without a very dark environment, such as a basement with blackout curtains, there is a noticeable degradation and picture quality. And while the screen is easy to build it's also easy to tip over. Fortunately, a few sturdy weights. This from happening, and we think the great picture quality is enough to mitigate these issues. Number 1. Elite Screens VMA X2 We think that right now, the best projector screen needs to be automated, easy to set up and use, and guarantee a particular level of picture quality. In our opinion, the Elite Screens VMA X2 ticks all three boxes. For starters, not only do you get a very sizable usable area, but you get a slightly increased aspect ratio, at 1610. There is a full 180 degree viewing angle, and like many models in this range, it comes ready for both 4K and 3D viewing. Installation is dead simple, as it comes shipped fully assembled and you won't have to get up to adjust it, either, as it comes with its own remote. It's a clear choice over screens from Silver Ticket, its big competitor. That said, we do think the price could stand to drop a little. The Elite Screens VMA X2 comes in multiple sizes, like most screens here, but to be honest, it's still a little expensive for what it is. If you're looking for a less expensive automated screen, Check out the description for more information in latest price.